Cases continue to increase. Many are asking how easily can the virus spread from person to person? Yeah, specifically, can you get monkeypox from attending a concert? Or what about trying on clothes in a fitting room or changing the sheets of someone infected? CBS 8's Jasmine Ramirez talked to an infectious disease doctor about what poses the most risk. This weekend, a music festival will be happening here at Waterfront Park. So what are the chances for an attendee to get monkeypox? Health officials say the risk is fairly low. Monkeypox began making headlines in May. What started this was likely more like raves, like these were, you know, gay male, bi gay and bisexual men being together really close, lots of sexual contact in Spain and Belgium, and that's what started it. So sort of general population festivals I'm not worried about. The CDC says festivals and events where people are fully clothed are much safer. The virus mainly spreads through skin to skin contact with someone who has obvious rashes or lesions. Although it's possible for monkeypox to spread by trying on clothing or changing sheets of someone who was infected, Dr. Monica Gandhi says the chances are much less likely. Sharing clothes or sharing a towel, sharing fomite surfaces that we're all going to be doing day to day, we would have had massive spread if it was readily spread like this. California health officials have reported 98.3% of cases are in men, and the majority identify in the LGBTQ community. It's part of public health that if it starts in a network, it seems to be staying in that network. It's a theme seen with past outbreaks. An analogy I would use is just before COVID, we had a mumps outbreak going on in San Diego amongst college students. That was the group that it was circulating in. That was the subpopulation that socialized together. Which is why the county is focusing its first vaccine doses on people at the highest risk. It's actually good public health to say it's in this population, gay men, Let's get the resources to that population. San Diego County has received nearly 4,000 vaccines and distributed nearly 2,500. They're hoping for more vaccines to arrive soon. And as for the music festival, Day Moves is a three-day event and tickets for Saturday are already sold out. Jasmine Ramirez, CBS 8.